you get diagnosed with HIV. The clinic tells you, don't worry, we've got great treatment. Just take one tablet a day, every day, and you live a normal life. But then it sinks in. This is for life. You will be taking these pills every single day, even if your HIV is controlled. Why? Because of something called HIV reservoirs. These are like tiny pockets in your body where the virus hides kind of like dormant spies. They're asleep, invisible on tests. But if you stop taking your meds, they can wake up and reactivate the virus. That's why the doctors say you cannot stop. But what if that's about to change? What if you could stay undetectable without taking daily pills? What if just two injections could keep the virus under control for a year or even more? That's exactly what researchers are testing right now in a breakthrough trial called Rio. And the initial results are seriously exciting. Let me explain. So, what are BNABs? That stands for Broadly Neutralizing Antibodies. But let's break that down. When you get a vaccine, like for COVID or for the flu, your body learns to make antibodies. These antibodies act like your immune system's security guards. They recognize viruses and block them if they try to infect you. Now, BNABs are like the supercharged versions of those antibodies. Scientists make them in a lab, but they work just like your own immune system, only better. They can target lots of different types of HIV, not just one. So when someone gets an injection of them, the antibodies go around the body, spotting HIV and stopping it from spreading, even without daily pills. So let's look at what happened in this Rio study. Researchers gave 68 people living with HIV two long-acting BNABs. 3BN-C11-LS and 10-1074-LS. Then these people were told to stop their usual HIV medication. Scary, right? But here's what happened. 75% of them kept their viral load suppressed for at least 20 weeks. And that's without taking daily meds. And some people went over a year without their HIV coming back. One person stayed undetectable for seven 72 weeks. Professor Sarah Fidler, the chief investigator of the study, said, quote, This is the first time a long-acting immune-based therapy has shown sustained viral control in multiple participants, allowing them to stop their daily HIV medication for over a year. These results could open new avenue for HIV treatment, bringing us closer to our ultimate goal of a cure. Now that's a powerful state because until now, we We've always said, take your tablets for life. But these results suggest that some people might control HIV with just a few infusions a year. And just think about what that could mean in real life. No more worrying about carrying pills on holidays. No more hiding your meds or setting daily reminders. For many, it could mean less anxiety, more freedom, and fewer awkward questions from people who still don't understand what HIV is. It could even help fight the stigma. Because when you're not tied to daily pills, it becomes one less visible reminder for you and for others that you are living with HIV. One or two injections a year and you just get on with your life. That's the kind of simplicity and dignity everyone deserves. But that's not all. The real trial also found something even more exciting. The BNABs didn't just keep HIV under control. Remember the HIV reservoirs, the tiny pockets in your body where the virus hides? BNABs Apps actually reduced the size of these HIV reservoirs. And in some people, it became undetectable. Now that's a huge deal because to ever cure HIV, we have to get rid of that hidden reservoir. Now, please note that it is still early. The study is ongoing and will finish around 2027. But what we've seen so far is very promising. Let's be clear, this isn't a cure, but it's hope. Hope for less stigma. Hope for simpler, freer lives. Hope that living with HIV doesn't have to mean living by the pill bottle. We're not just talking about numbers on a graph. We are talking about real people getting a piece of their normal life back. A life with fewer 
fewer reminders and more room to just be. If this moved you, let's talk about it. Drop your thoughts in the comments. Would you want this kind of treatment or what would it change for you or someone you love? And don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on the latest in HIV, sexual health and men's health. I'm Abhishek and until next time, stay safe folks.